Okay, in this epic, I've given you the actual full view of the epic and not just the stage scoring view. So we see the respirations, the SpO2, everything. Okay, so you'll notice highlighted in yellow or outlined in yellow here, um, the first nine seconds of the epic. That is actually awake, stage W, for those first nine seconds. And then right here about second 10, 11 here, the patient actually falls asleep. So that's then N1. Then we look over here and what is this little guy that is nice and big right here? Well, it is over half a second long. It has a sharp negative deflection followed by a positive uh, deflection. So that is actually a K complex. So we actually have three different um, criteria for three different stages all in one epic. So how do we actually come to a conclusion? Well, we can rule out that is it is wake because um, there's only nine seconds of the epic made up of wakefulness. We do not see any spindles. And so really when the first view of uh, possible stage two comes at second 25, okay? Wow, I am trying to outline that, but I am not doing a great job, okay? So only five seconds of the epic are made up of stage N2. So it can't be N2. We cannot score it as N2. So that means the remaining part of the epic, which is from here to here, oops, um, so that is about 14 seconds of the epic are stage N1. So we would actually score this as stage N1. Okay, so again, we go by the majority of the epic and the characteristics that correspond to a specific stage, and that's how you're going to come up with stage scoring for each epic. Just a reminder the goal right now is to be able to identify. The stage of sleep of one epic. That is um, what your competency is going to be over for this course at this time. Next quarter we will dive into more of the scoring details and you'll actually be scoring an, an entire record and not just one epic at a time.